Hey Capricorn, what's up? What's up, my lovely Capricorns? I hope you guys are doing great. Uh, Capricorn, I really just want to thank you so much for your love and your light, for your support, all of your likes, your comments, your subscriptions. I truly appreciate each and every one of you. And I'm sending you guys out um, many blessings. So Capricorn, we're going to just do a quick read here, check in on what the energy is uh, around you, what you guys can expect. Um, you know, we're going to find out what spirit wants you to know right now. So spirit guides, angels, Archangel Michael, please bring through messages that <clears throat> Capricorns need to hear right now from spirit. Please bring through messages for Capricorn. What does Capricorn need to know? Eight of wands, movement in some area, some sort of movement, Capricorn. Um... I'm going to take it. The Three of Wands, the Emperor, and the Four of Swords. So, someone's been waiting, I think, and the timing is there's movement now. Someone was waiting before they made a move. Um, maybe it's this Emperor, you know, or it's an Emperor energy, but there's going to be some sort of a timeout, a breakup, a separation. Yep, Nine of Wands, so someone's putting a burden down, some sort of burden being put down, and it has to do with an Emperor energy. Oh boy, and the Empress. So we've got a couple here. Wow. Capricorn, it looks like someone's making a decision. It's like the wait is over. What else, Spirit? What else? The Lovers, the Ace of Cups, Queen of Swords, King of Wands. Too many things going on here. Page of Swords, Six of Swords. Ay, ay, ay. I'm getting the sense here. Of Wands, Eight of Cups, Tower. Okay, so guys, I know we have a couple here, the Emperor and the Empress. I'm getting the sense though that, yeah, there's some sort of justice that's coming in. I'm getting the sense that someone here. And I feel like it's both of them have downgraded to a Queen of Swords and a King of Wands. And there's been a tower. Um, there's, you know, another king here. The, the <laughs> Three of Swords now. I think that this Queen of Swords, who was the Empress has um, put the, the emperor who's the king of wands in a third party situation here and it's caused a breakup. Oh, codependent, the devil. Yeah. You know, this is Capricorn energy. So, you know, there's, there's a breakup. There's a third party situation. This has been an absolute flipping nightmare. And someone is here with the Eight of Cups walking away from a passionate new beginning. They're walking away or there was there's a tower because of a new beginning. Someone's been doing that. It's like it's been going on for some time. Tell me, tell me more. Four cups. Yeah, it's like someone's been focusing on someone else and, and not paying attention to, to their family, I'm hearing. And spirits here. Spirits like, no, 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 we're, we're not doing this anymore. 
play your energy with the Knight of Wands. So it's spirit is shining. You know, spirit is uh, has got the sword out and is like cutting through the bullshit now and saying, look, you, you need to see this. Someone's got options. Like there's options here. You you need to you need to know this now. I feel as though like both of these people have done this to each other. And this is, you know, so someone's been stuck. This has been a stuck energy for quite some time. It's, there's been no movement. But now these secrets are coming out. I feel like there's even a, a higher involvement here there's about to a cop seriously like about a soulmate connection there's secrets there's really deep-seated secrets in this situation Capricorn yep lies betrayal cheating deception and the five of swords this is like really hard energy this is really cutthroat energy but I feel as though it's mm, Queen of Pentacles here, so feminine, you know, pentacle energy can be a Capricorn. Someone was cheating, and it's it's you know not a celebration. There's there's no celebration. There's no working anymore on a family situation. That's what I'm hearing. It's like no ten of swords. It's the Ten of Swords with the Page of Wands. It's like someone got the messages. The messages have come in. No, no Seven of Pentacles. There's no reaping the reward from the seeds. There, there's none. There, there's, it's not happening. You know, this is the chariot here. This is like about... You know movement oh yeah it's coming in quick this is okay I hate to say it because the chariot is also about health it is the health card but with the death card like this really could be a death I'm, I'm sorry it could be an ending of something but it really could be a death Capricorn someone could die here because they were acting a fool like, I'm even picking up maybe STDs here. Is it this King of Pentacles? Like, what in the heck? What in the heck? The sun. Two of Swords. Someone being confused, but the sun is shining now. Like... This this could put this person in like to having suicidal thoughts. You know, like look at this card. This is the Celtic deck, so you know it can it. it I'm just saying, like look at there. There's heads on a stick down there. Like this could be seriously someone having suicidal thoughts because of this third part. Three of Cups, because of this third party situation. Someone is finding something out about someone, about the person they were in a relationship with, someone who was the Emperor or the Empress. I don't care. I think that there's been a downgrade for both people. Yep, because someone has been in the Knight of Cups energy, a flirt, um, a player, having sex with multiple people, and someone's found out. And the wheel of, of the karmic wheel is here, but all I keep seeing is like a pregnant belly. So, you know, if it's not someone's pregnant, it's just like the birthing something new, or it's like you know, getting out there, and I mean, it's just gross. Hermit, Five of Cups, so someone's being regretful. They're in hermit mode, being regret regretful. Ten of Wands here. 
Two of Wands making a decision to, to put some burden down the King of Cups. Seriously, there's judgment here. There's too many men. There's too many masculine energies here. Someone was manipulative. Ten of Cups in reverse, guys. It's in reverse. So this feminine energy was playing, you know, there's fighting. Ugh, the feminine energy, it was playing the field. With passion, like getting their passion. Being passionate with other people, there's a change. <laughs> They're trying to bring in an offer. They're trying to, now they're trying to be like, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to. They're trying to trap this person into taking them back. Let's work on our stability. Let's like, let's come back together and, and let's work on this. We're meant to be together. I didn't mean to. I was drunk. And this person is like, no, 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 no. You know, Ace of Pentacles in reverse. There's no money here. There's no love left here. There's no trust. I keep hearing no trust. Yeah, Four of Pentacles, letting go, releasing, not holding on to something anymore. So someone's releasing this time and they're doing it for good. They're, they know better now. They are starting over with the Page of Pentacles. So there's a masculine energy here that is has made the decision to start over. They are no longer giving in to um, this feminine energy that put them in a third party situation. They're going to go work on their Pentacles, their money. Yep, they are. They're going to go work on their money. They're going to work on being fair with the Six of Pentacles. Heal. They're going to go, they're going to take the time to heal. They're learning about equal give and take. They're learning because I think they weren't, they didn't in the past either. Yep. They're learning a spiritual lesson with the Hierophant. They're taking action like this is I, I feel like, you know, in the Knight of Swords here, um, that can be a real like sudden not thinking about it energy. But I think in this case, spirit is saying, you know, it might be the it is the best thing in this in instance um, for this person um, just because of the circumstances. It's like, be in your angry, you know, thoughts and, and just, you know, get away because that time away, um, is going to help you realize like all the betrayal, all the deception, all the lies. It's going to help whoever this is for realize, uh, you know, about the juggling, the back and forth and how it's not serving anyone all the secrets. It's like this person's going to use their intuition. This person who's walking away is using their intuition with the high priestess and they're going to go towards wish fulfillment. This is like having hope. This is knowing that there's something better for, for you out there, Wh whoever this resonates with. There's like a queen of cups energy out there for this masculine energy. This is in unconditional love. It's unconditional love that's waiting for them. Yeah, the Five of Wands, it's like um, resolving the issues here, that there's like conflicts. I think it had to do, yeah, this is a, this, this is a past person that is waiting for them that is meant to be with this masculine energy. Yeah, this person left him out in the cold, left him hanging. Even if the Queen of Cups walked away, it's like the... The masculine energy here was already doing something that made the, yeah, that made the Queen of Cups single, choose to be single because whatever was happening here, this Queen of Cups did, knew that that's not what was meant for them. So they had the strength to walk away. And it's been that it was, that was a victory. And now Spirit is saying, 
Capricorn, whoever this is for, it is your destiny to walk away from the person that you're, you're dealing with, the karmic person. They are a karmic and they're making your life a living hell. They are um, betraying you. They're lying you to you, deceiving you. Um, I feel like they're stealing money, um, pocketing money. Um, there's a lot of things you don't know about this person. You might want to do a background check on them, honestly. You, you might want to like dig into their background and see if there's court documents about this person because Archangel Michael's telling me there is, okay? Um, so Capricorn, that's what I have for you guys. Um, sending you guys so much love and lots of blessings. Um, wishing you all the best and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye Capricorn.